2023 brought a lot of challenges to those in the car market, but it also brought some good. News 9's Jessica Riley has more on what the market looks like currently and into 2024. Over the past few years, many industries took a hit with product shortages in the car market industry being no stranger to that. But as we head into 2024, what does this look like? The shortage affecting the used car market tremendously in the past couple of years, 2023 finally brought a good sign. The used car market really went, is getting better. Um, the demand is still there. The prices are coming down. We're Early in 2023, we saw them going up. Another issue was inventory and the lack of new vehicles they were able to get into dealerships. But Showalter says it's gotten better, but they want to see an increase in trucks. I think that the demand for, for new car vehicles is, is still high. And it's getting, I think it's going up because we didn't have cars and trucks a couple of years ago. So I still see the demand for, for the new um, rising. And while you may be looking at price tags on a car, it's important to pay attention to those interest rates as well. The interest rates, as everybody knows, interest rates have been going up. Uh, 2023 brought some uh, interest rate hikes, which nobody wants to see. Um, but this year, we're told that hopefully by the end of the first quarter, um, that they're going to start dropping the interest rates uh, little by little. Show Walter says typically the interest rates are sitting about 5 to 6 percent, but this depends on the consumer. In uh, 2024, I think the demand's going to stay there, the prices are going to stay where they should be, and the interest rates are finally going to start coming back at us. So um, I think that's going to be a great thing. In Belmont County, reporting for News 9, I'm Jessica Riley. I'm Gianna Dupre. Thank you for watching. Here's another video for you to watch and please take some time to subscribe to our channel.